Shimizu will not allow his 2023 presidential victory to be stolen MDC Alliance leader Nelson Shimizu says he will not allow his victory in the 2023 presidential election to be stolen again as was the case in 2018. Shimizu contested the 2018 presidential election and came second to President Emerson Manangagwa who narrowly won the highly disputed poll. However, the opposition leader contested the result insisting the Zimbabwe Electoral Commission, ZEC, had tampered with the outcome in favor of Manangagwa. He took the matter to the Constitutional Court but the judges dismissed the matter. Chamisa still insists he was rightful winner of the election and has adamantly refused to recognize Manangagwa as president. Addressing mourners Saturday at a memorial service for late MDC Alliance Glenview North MP Kennedy Dunar in the same suburb in Harare, Chamisa told hundreds of mourners gathered, he would in 2023 ensure that the will of the people who vote for him is respected. We don't want to get into a useless election. The people's vote should be respected and that is the fight we are having with Zainu PF, Shimiza said. He said if he failed to guard his victory in the next presidential election, Zimbabwe's political and economic crisis would never end. Once we fail to deal with that issue then none of the country's challenges will be solved. I even told that to South African President Cyril Ramaphosa about this, he said. However, the opposition leader did not explain how he intended to protect his victory. Shamiza added the interference by Manangagwa and the ruling party, Zainu PF on the electoral system had made the majority of Zimbabweans to believe that elections were unnecessary. Recently, Vice President Constantino Kiwenga banned the holding of by-elections as a measure to stop the spread of COVID-19. Chamisa also described allegations by outgoing U.S. President Donald Trump that elections in that country had been rigged as utterances by a man under pressure. Look at what is happening in America, even the incumbent is crying foul that he has been rigged. He is under pressure, said Chamisa amid laughter from mourners. It is a just system though and it allows that. Here the issue is that Manangagwa did not forgive us for the 2018 elections when we took him to court contesting the outcome of the presidential election. Trump lost the U.S. presidential election held last week to a rival Democrat candidate Joe Biden.